Hello and welcome to Let's Play Europa Universalist 3 Divine Wind with your host Shenror, currently playing as Bihari Hindustan. Hindustan, we got our curve back, hell yeah. The year is 1733, I had planned on waiting a few more years until doing what I wanted to do, which was go to war with Scotland and take London so that they can't form Great Britain, because they have five more years until they can form Great Britain. However, they are currently at war with Naples, Ragusa, Burgundy, Bar, Trier, Navarre, and Hainaut. And they're also at war with Hausa. So, I get the feeling that now is a good time to engage Scotland. They're fighting Hausa down here. They're definitely fighting some naval battles with Burgundy. And they may even be fighting here in the mainland. They may be fighting over here in the new territories. Looks like Portugal and Burgundy are fighting. So, I'm going to get in on this war now rather than later. The only territory I'm going to take is London. Don't want anything else, just London. So to get ready for that, I need to bring my navy over, pick up an army. I'll leave that one there, leave that one. I'm building a new one here. This one's fine, this one's fine. I need to build a new army here. This army's gonna come. Boats are healthy. Good, good. Get on the boat. I'll leave my Chinese army. Leave my Chinese navy as well. Pacific navy, Pacific army, you guys can all just stay put. I don't think Scotland has anything down here. I could invade up here if I get access rights through these guys, but since we... Oh, we just had a war with Castile. They're willing to give us access. What about you guys? Yeah. Okay, so if they want to, we'll just march up here and take over this part of Scotland. And that should make for a pretty easy war. I'm pretty sure my navy can take them out. That's what I could do with my Pacific fleet, since you guys aren't going to do anything else. You guys are going to go fight your, the naval pat battles. Come on, follow the coast. Don't take uh, war exhaustion. Jeez. Nope, follow the coast. Come on. Should be an option. Checkbox or something. Follow the coast. So checkbox, don't be dumb. Checkbox, don't take attrition. Look at this. This douchebag wants to go out here instead of following the coast. I have to start my stupid pathing over. Where is my checkbox for not taking attrition? Now you can take a little attrition crossing that gap. Alright, we're good. Yeah, I think that's a coast. Yeah, that's coast. Alright, we're good. Actually, just keep going around. And then come up here. Yep. And go over there. Yep. Alright. Undock already. Good news. We have access. And go sit up here. Oh, on that note, we just gained a core in Porto. So it's been 50 years since we took this from Portugal. Portugal is also allied with Scotland, so we may be using that army to fight around in Portugal over here. I don't know. I may take something in Portugal. I don't really want anything over here. That thing's worthless. That's even more worthless. These are the two that are worth something. Eh, maybe I'll take Beira. Whatever. Not super interested. What are the ones that are worth the most here? Essex. Ooh, lots of cloth. Yorkshire. So pretty much... Pretty much just Essex and the two iron, Yorkshire and Norfolk. Alright, well, not going to worry about it. I could probably make them spit out Wales, but Wales would only get one territory because they revoked Wales' core here in Glamorgan. Anyway, undock the boats, get on the boats. Still colonizing Australia, very cool. All right, you guys are on the boat. Good job. I'm going to go this way. Not taking attrition. Not taking attrition. Not taking attrition. Oh, good job not taking attrition, boys. Very good job. We're going to invade the south. Because screw the north. Oh, they have Iceland as well. I might have to invade over here, too. I lost my ally Yaroslavl because they wanted to... Uh... Yaroslavl attacked my other ally, Lithuania. So I said, screw it. You guys can fight on your own. I'm not going to get involved. Hmm. 
I guess I could bring one arm, another army down. Go take their spot in Pensa. Oh, Hausa got out of the war with Scotland. That's okay. We got our dudes coming up. I guess we can take over that territory, huh? Oh, Trebizond nationalists. Yeah, we might as well. Well, is it worth anything? Oh, it's grapes. Hmm. Maybe I'll take that and London. Eh, we'll see. I'm so indecisive sometimes. Alright, you're on the boat. Good, good, good. To England. Oh. Killing some rebels for Castile? Whatever. Still colonizing Australia. Some good Russian patriots. Oh, pirates. Alright, good. War! Who's gonna join me? Everyone's gonna join me. Awesome. Get off the damn boat. So get off the damn boat. What do they have? Eight dudes. Nope, you're gonna die. Scottish Africa. Ha! Huh, any of these colonies? That one's a colony. These two are colonies, so I can steal some colonies. <laughs> any these worth anything? I think I checked before and they were pretty worthless. Yeah, they're worthless. Alright, Lithuania didn't come, Guyenne came, Hesse came, Portugal dishonored. Okay. Japan game. So, Scotland's going to go it alone. Government tech up. Very cool. Come on. There you go. Alright. We'll engage the enemy in Wessex. And I don't see their navy anywhere. I mean, they might be somewhere that I just can't see. So, what we're going to do is patrol around the island. There we go. Now if they undock, they're boned. So I'm going to patrol my other navy the other direction around the island. Oh. Alright, you're done there. Siege it. Cool, they're dead. Alright. Now, uh... I give you a general. You get that one. And for Kent. Siege it. The whole one for it. Level three in London. It's okay, we'll go for it eventually. Where's my other army? Wait, who's this? Achaia. Hi, right, you guys are at war with Achaia now. Well, they better not go to London. They better not steal my freaking uh, kills there. Oh, Guillen's coming. Hello, Guillen. With your one transport of awesomeness. All right, we landed in London. End of the month, wait. All right, now siege it. Right, you guys go this way. No, go this way. Actually, go this way and then here. Yeah. Oh, cool. You're ready. I'll pick you up in a minute. Chill. Alright, you guys are ready. Start patrolling and you're gonna go this way. Screw you, Scotland. Tried to work with you so many times, but you're just dicks. After all that planning, I told you go to not go to the Bay of Biscay, but you went there anyway because you're dicks.
discovered Kano. It's nice. And we're almost to Scottish Africa. Hurry up and get off the damn boat. Lots of level one forts over here. All right, the Indian fleet's the one that's going to pick these dudes up. Not sure I even need them anymore. Does Scotland even have an army? They do. Where the hell is their army? Maybe they're hiding up here? I don't see them. Maybe they're up in Iceland. Oh, look at Guyen up in Iceland. Oh, that is just awesome. I guess I could spit out Nor No, Norway still exists. They have one territory. Oh, maybe Scotland's army's over there. Whatever. What's her war score? 21. Can I get London? I can. Oh, I forgot to take this territory. Well, since I'm, since I'm not looking for amazingly huge infamy, maybe I should just take my... Uh, Take my profits and move on. Oh, I have to build some buildings. Uh, can I build level 1 forts anywhere? No. Okay. Should build some manufactories, huh? So my highest production number is coffee, which you can't do any buildings with coffee, so. Just pick either university or... What's the other one you get? Fine arts, I think? Yep. Doesn't get effect by any goods that you have. So this one does stability investment and cultural tradition, and this one does government tech investment. And I think the stability investment's more... The stability investment and cultural tradition are better. Alright, who else has high production? Nanjing does Chinaware, which does not get affected by any of these goodies. Wine and sugar, naval supplies, copper, iron, nothing, nothing, cloth and wool. So yeah, Chinaware doesn't do anything. So I get either university or fine arts, and I think I like fine arts a little better. Oh, I can do... Oh, that's right, I have five dudes. Alright, cotton, that's for textile, right? Wool or cloth? How is cotton not good for textiles? Either this thing is buggy, or it's part of the beta patch, or it's just silly. All right, more fine arts. Chinaware, more fine arts. And we're done. Oh, we're done because I'm almost out of money. That's a good reason to finish. Okay, we killed them in Kaffa. Siege it. Thank you. Siege it. Alright, so I could take that and London, but then I'd be up to 19 infamy. Not very attractive, so. Let's see. I want London and I want you to spit out. Wow, look at all these people you can spit out. You can spit out England! Oh ho ho! Look at that! <laughs> ah! Oh, oh, that, I think that should be my goal, because screw all these other ones. Who cares? Corsica. You can spit out Corsica. I'm going to make them spit out England. That would be so hilarious. All these forts are level 1 except for London. What the hell was that? About, oh. You guys know? I saw an event. What was it? Something over here? I'm a little confused. I don't know what happened. I, I missed it. I clicked it away. It is gone now. It's okay though. Oh, that's what it was. Maybe. Right about those guys. Oh, yes. 
I could just seize those colonies for a little bit of infamy, but I'm not gonna. Whoa! <laughs> Scotland, you actually came. That's hilarious. Oh, look, Scotland has a navy, and they're not running away. Alright, kill them. And then come back. Oh, they're running. Now you're running. Now I have to catch them. What else happened? You guys, oh, you finished Yorkshire. Gotcha. Oh, they're freaking gonna get away. I know how to pinch them in. Awesomeness. Stop patrolling. Go here. You guys are so freaking boned, you don't even know. Wow, you must have a admiral with good maneuver. Crimea. There we go. Oh, they ran right into me. Ha. Oh, poor guys. I feel for them, really. Oh, they actually have a fort in Lothian. It's amazing. Oh, they showed up here. Oh yeah, 50%. I guess we have to go a little further. Oh, they want white peace. At 50% you want white peace? Really? Level 1 fort. Of course it's a level 1 fort. Alright, we won in Gibraltar. We lost quite a few ships. We lost a bunch of transports. But they ran away. I guess I should get some admirals, huh? I could have all the fleets in the world, and it won't matter if they have better admirals. Alright, we killed that army, that navy. You can't catch a navy for some reason. So anyway, my European fleet now needs nine new light ships and 35 new transports. That is really freaking gay. So go dock up. Fifty-five percent. Will you give me what I want? Which is London and free England? They will. Wow. They will give me London, they will free England, they will not remove their core on Cape. I want them to remove their core on Cape. So one more territory. And this shit's over. Benin. Foy lost to Burgundy. Of course they lost to Burgundy. Why would you even fight Burgundy? Wow, so getting Benin went, made our score go from 55 to 55. Benin is obviously worth a lot to them. revolts now.
Uh, you guys go there. Now we're at 56. Alright, so that should be enough to get this and spit out England and let go of Cape. Awesome. That is ridiculously awesome. We're going to make them spit out England. Look how big that is. I don't know if you can tell with the colors. Alright, we're doing it. Money? Nope. There we go. Look at that shit. We got London. Made them spit out England. So now they're about on even terms with England, except they have a lot of colonies and England does not. So stop patrolling. You guys should go pick up one of these armies. For infamy for all that shit, that's pretty pro. And England's my ally. Give them access. Well, that could have gone a little better, but I'd say it went pretty good, pretty well. Indian fleet can pick up the other army. There's my Indian army. So you should pick up this one. Why don't you take the path that doesn't give you attrition, you dumbass? Oh, England broke their alliance with us already. Probably because we have <laughs> their old capital, London. That is nice, though. Supply limit 88. That is insane. Oh, yeah. You should probably go back. Just saying. Go dock in London. Get on the boat. Alright, so this is now my London army. Oops. Pacific Fleet can go back to the Pacific. Uh, you guys were stationed. Oh, that's right, I had to make that silly little route for you because you can't figure this out on your own. You're like, I want attrition. It's like, no, you can't have attrition. There. Cool. Oh, that means we can do the next one in Thang Long. Finally got the highest end uh, conscription army thingy for manpower and force limits. Very cool. Ah, uh, war exhaustion didn't go too high in this arm in this fight. Good. It was still coming down from 18 in the last one, you know. Right. Actually, you can be my new van army. I will have to build. No, I don't think I need two armies up there. I think I'm okay with just that one. And so. Uh, we only gained one territory. I guess we could build another army if we wanted. No, because I have to replace some of the dudes that... I didn't lose any army, did I? No, I lost some navy. That really sucks. So, build some navy. Nine. Nine. And you have a lot of army to build, so I guess I'll just keep building here. Um, mm hmm. Wait, 9, so 20 would be 11. I need 35, so 24. I'll do 20, and I'll do the other 4 over here. Everyone in Europe is at war, I get it. Steel still has some territories they didn't get back from Brittany, it looks like. Ooh, uh, we have a interpreter missionary to London with you.
rename you to Van Siege. Free Temple. I do like Free Temples. Aha, we finished in Mojave. Build a fort. And now we can colonize past there. Do we touch anything else? No. For some reason, they want you to go one, two, three. You can't, like, go around. Oh well. So now Scotland cannot form Great Britain. And neither can England, can England so screw them. London is mine, bitches. And trades out of my trade center of Antwerp. Lovely. Although it's worthless now because Burgundy has their own down here in Burgundy, so they used to split half their trade through Antwerp and half through Burgundy, but now they all go through Burgundy because we took Antwerp from them. It's okay, Europe can hate me, I don't care. It's not like they're going to form the uh, HRE anytime soon. Look at this, 4% and they only have one reformed on. Look at all the stuff they have to do. No HRE. Alright, so Yaroslav got bigger. They annexed someone. And we gained liberation against our old ally. Pretty hilarious. Let me send an insult. So in case we do have to go to war with them, it won't be hard. That's what she said. Wait, Scotland's at war with Burgundy. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> Look at Scotland over here in Holland. It's kind of cute. Admiral's concerned. I'm not going to gain naval. Cool, converted some people. Manpower. I mean, not manpower. Base tax. Always base tax. What was that? Munster entered an alliance with Scotland. Oh, okay. Wow, look at Austria over here. That's what being the Holy Roman Emperor does for you, because you get like, you get a, a force limit modifier. Let's see, what do you get? Diplomats plus one, magistrates plus point two, spy efficiency up five, manpower up 20,000, land force limits plus 82. That's huge. Well, now we border them over here, so maybe we'll have to go to war with the HRE more often. We will see. Oh, you didn't kill them? Why did you not kill them? Go kill them. Do not fail. Dumbass. Uh, why are there so many freaking things popping up? Pause the damn game. Magistrate. Agriculture Revolution. Give me base tax. Now, Emperor has made a request for the release of Zealand. This doesn't make any sense. You want us to give Zealand to the HRE. We are India. Do you get that? We are not part of the HRE. We never were part of the HRE. We didn't secede from the HRE. You can't make this request. This doesn't make any sense. This shouldn't happen between the HRE and India. I'm going to have to start wasting magistrates to remove territory from... So I'm going to have to start wasting magistrates on this bullshit. Really? Oh, there goes my stability. What a waste. What a fucking waste. Okay, looks like I need to insult Austria. And then I can remove shit. Why can't I remove shit? 
I do have worse relations. How long do you have to wait before I can do this? It says I don't have bad enough relations, but I do. This is a real pain in the butt. Lose prestige or lose stability? Well, that's a hard decision. Castile will see Cape Verde. Where the hell's Cape Verde? Oh, that's down here, huh? Yep, Milan has that now. Blah, blah, blah. Can I remove it now? No. Now can I remove it? It's the end of the month. Still can't remove it. Oh, I have to be lower than zero, not just lower than 100. Okay, well, I'll have to insult you two more times. How dumb is that? This is part of the reason why I didn't want to be one of the European HRE countries, because they always had this kind of bullshit going on. Oh, I have a subjugation causes belly on she. I forgot about that. Uh, am I a truce with you? No. Okay. Subjugation. There. Khmer honored, Korea honored. Oh, everyone's going to war. Oh, fantastic. Except you. Everyone except you. All right, you're going. You're in war. You are almost done. Uh, actually, you're not almost done. Huh. You can go ahead. Where's my Corallis army? I never brought them hat. They're just sitting on the boat, taking attrition. Wow, I'm an idiot. How did I not notice that? That is just amazing. My Corallis army is just sitting over there. You're going to go all the way over here, you're going to dock right... Actually, Korea joined, didn't they? Then you're going to dock right here, Jola. Oh, and all this crap has to happen again. This can't, this can't be done automatically, there's no macros in the game. No, no, dock the fuck up. Uh, probably dock them up once they're done. What a waste of time this is. The fact that I have to do this and the fact that you have to watch this is just an amazing waste of time in this game. Are you quite done? Nope. I was lucky I didn't have to do this when I was fighting Scotland, because we had their navy under control for the most part. Oh, Burgundy took something off Scotland. Cool. That should be enough, right? Don't have to do all of them. You're not going to go to Hawaii. Oh, text message, hold on. And we're back. And that's the last of my boats. So hopefully that's enough. I'm hoping. Oh, that's right, you guys can come down. I'm not going to bring too many over because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have some freaking revolts during this, I'm sure of it. Wu is the leader. 
Oh, so I don't even need to bother with Keen. Uh, okay, don't bother with Keen. Just go here. Wu is a leader. Then uh, go to Wu. Right, we're all docking up. I'm proud of you guys. You you know how to dock up. It's amazing. Good for you. Oh, we're embargoed by the Ming. Oh, Ming has boats out here now. Will you please dock the hell up? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Nope, still, still can't leave. Still can't leave. Uh-huh. Nope, ship died. Couldn't leave. Oh, well. Good thing I have extras being built. Oh, there's my navy right there. Why didn't I just undock my... Oh, man, I'm an idiot. I'm a freaking moron. Dutch nationalists, really? What was that last thing? Gain Crimea as a core. That's nice. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Didn't it say their fortress under siege somewhere? Laid siege to Haiyan. Where the hell's Haiyan? Oh, there it is. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'll let you go there. You go here. There we go. Hello, Ming. Hello, Ming. Oh, look. Oh. You're dead, Ming. Oh, I have to build some shit, don't I? Ports are blockaded. Who cares? Level 1 fort. Very cool. Yep, yep, yep. Siege it. Yep. Alright, so we're blockading them. And I'm guessing Ming went somewhere. Somewhere that I didn't dock up one of my stupid patrols, because I'm not paying that much attention. You guys need to hurry up. They're already done, look at that. Siege it. And you need a general so that you can catch them. Perfect. Well, we caught you. You're dead. Alright, go back to Shanghai. Don't need you anymore. Where is my Indian fleet? There it is. Oh, I don't even need you guys. Just go dock up. Don't be dumb. And... War's almost over anyway. Pirate raid, whatever. Level 1 fort, very cool. Ow. What? Oh, whatever. I guess I can undock my ships now. See it. Start patrolling, and you're done in Fuju, then go here. Actually, I would like to take Fuju and Wenzo. So I'm going to lose two infamy anyway. I might as well link up some of my land, right? This will be eight infamy. This will be negative two infamy. Yeah, I think I'll do that. That'll be nice. Alright, let's see what Khmer wants out of this peace deal, huh? Oh, white peace. Okay. Goodbye, Khmer. Thanks for coming. I appreciate the, uh, whatever. You guys are back home. You guys are going there. You guys need to hurry up. There we go. Siege it. And this should be the end of the war here. Go back to Handan. Go around. No, go around. 
you fucking retard, go around. Oh. Nope. Oh my god. Oh, we engaged them. No, seven ships, no! Oh, they're dead. Alright, so I can end the war now. I want negative two infamy here. Vassalize, revoke core, or release treaties, blah blah blah. Negative two infamy? Bingo! Very cool. Now give me these two. Oh, oh they will not. 56%. Uh, that means I need to get Keen out of the war. No, oh, can I surrender? No. Very lame. Alright, go there. Didn't think I would have to do this much work, really. Lame. Very lame. Whatever. I thought the war would be over. I thought they would give those up easily. Why can I not send one? More than 450 from our closest thingamajiggy. It shouldn't be. I must have pirates over here. The only time that message comes up is when I have pirates. I do, right there, your body. Very lame. Do I have anything that can deal with them? Of course I do, I have this arm, this fleet. Kill those pirates. And then come back and dock up. Hurry up, siege it. Siege it. Siege it. Siege it. Ooh, missionary. Missionary. You guys converted? Yep. These guys need to be converted. I'll do that one first. How much did that say? 138 gold. Wow. Whatever. Siege it. Siege it. Siege it. Okay, you can go back to Guangzhou now. That should probably be enough to... Uh... Alright, you guys are finally home. Is that enough? 100%. Okay. So that was enough. I just needed GM. That's all I really want. That's 16 infamy. Revoke your core. Blah, blah. I could vassalize them. Nope. Alright, cool, that'll have to do, and then I'll deal with them again later to get more stuff. Go back to... no, go, go this way, through to Handan. You guys should go back to Kurtag, you're already... no, you're not going home, go home. And... undock, 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 go there. If you can do this fast enough, you don't get pirates, but I think I waited a little too long. I got some pirates. Pirates. Very lame. So we're back up to 16 infamy, but it's okay. 
Look at that, we now connect our territories. And I bet a lot of these can do... No. Nope. Coastal defense. Uh, oh, I need naval. No. Oh, military at least four. Does my dude not have military four? Military three. And yeah, my leader kind of sucks, but he has good dipl diplomacy, so... Whatever, I'll do those later. But yeah, we connected our stuff. Very cool. Yeah, this is a, something I would love to have a macro for. Oh, we saved Hanyang, apparently. News to me. see the freaking root. Look at that. Look at that. It shows there and it shows there, but if you zoom out, it doesn't. It only shows that part. Whatever. You don't need a root. You patrol down to here. Almost done. No, 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 no. Go up here, then there, then there. Build a fine arts academy in Hainan. Alright, I can handle that. That's the one I can't do until my fleet arrives. So hurry up and arrive, Mr. Fleet, so I can do this patrol. Um, you guys need to go back to Jugger, the war's over. Croatia collapsed. That's okay. Oh, I need to build some buildings. Buildings! up, Mr. Fleet. Look at that. He's up here, and it shows them as coming from down here. Discovered spy. I don't care. Oh, um, yeah, the war's over. Go home. Kind of suck for those guys. They've been marching for like a year. Alright, now we can patrol. Yep. You guys are golden, so hurry up with that thing, and then you're going to come down here. Then you're going to go home. Alright, so come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no, eight dudes. Might have to like send a second army down. Alright, good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot about these guys. I'm gonna go there, and then there, and then there, and then back to China. Now you're gonna start patrolling again. You guys are going to patrol up to here, and then over to here, and then back. There, all the pirates are gone. Everybody happy, pirates are gone. Actually, am I still at war with the Golden Horde? I am, but Venice, for some reason, Venice took over the land, but they have not started colonizing it. They've owned the land since about 1720 so like 16 years it's been sitting there in their in their control and they won't oh i lost baroque music i need baroque music i need a magistrate all right well hurry up but yeah venice for some reason won't colonize the damn thing it's like they're too lazy or they can't figure out the the way it works you're running to coruscant so you're going to go to coruscant Well, you're getting peace with everyone. Good for you. Except Burgundy, who is taking you over. Well, sort of. Burgundy's got three territories. Tripoli's independent. That's nice. We have a buttload of colonists that I can't use. I guess I need to take one of these up here so I can use my colonists. Mm. Oh, I can go there. I forgot, yeah, once I got rid of the pirates, I could easily go there. Oh well. That's what happens when you forget. I'm getting old, apparently. Oh, we can do Baroque music now. Baroque music, yay! Minus three revolt risk for the win. Now, I know we didn't do a whole lot this time. We had a war with Scotland. Which was very oh, important. Um, Whoa. Oh no. Wow, sorry about that. That was kind of loud. I had a war with Scotland and took London and made them spit out England. So that was a very interesting turn of events. I, w I didn't know I'd be able to make them spit out England, but I guess they didn't revoke enough cores. So, and we also had a tiny little war over here and took two more Chinese provinces. But hey, you know, uh, all's fair in love and war. Getting kind of worried about the HRE. Austria is becoming a bit of a power over here. And that's not that's that's really not cool. I mean this this all was Polotsk. All of this was Polotsk, and now it's all gone. Polotsk only has or Peskov. Or was it Polotsk? No, it was Polotsk. They must have annexed them entirely. Oh well. Anyway. Oh that's why it's slow. I'm running a virus scan. Hold on. One one sec. Much better. Anyway, had a little war took over some of Scotland. I lost some ships over here, so I'm rebuilding a bunch of ships in Imereti. Almost done with the new army in Georgia. It's going to be Georgia Siege. I left an army in London to protect it, so England doesn't get any bright ideas because they still have a core there. I still have two armies here in Iberia. I have another army in Croatia and a bunch of armies on the Western Front and some armies here in China. Still have an army in Los Angeles. Let me rename this so I can remember where I am. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. And Mojave. Yeah, well, that's fine. I know where Mojave is at least. But yeah. Our Navy performed kind of crappily. We engaged 100 ships versus like 60, and they killed all 35 transports and 9 of the light ships. I only killed like 4 of their ships, but I think it's just because they had an admiral. I didn't have any admiral at all. They probably had a good admiral too, because uh, my naval tech is pretty good. 33. Wow, my land tech's 44. Holy crap.
your navel's 31. Yeah, my navel's better than theirs, so I shouldn't shouldn't have lost that, but they ran away as soon as my second 100 navy showed up. Anyway, that was that war. It looks like Denmark and Norway, or Denmark and Sweden are going at it. Poland and Austria are probably going to be the main powers to deal with now because we cut Scotland down hugely. We cut Burgundy down a good deal, but we have not really made Poland or Austria any weaker, so maybe that'll be my next target is to weaken the uh, European powers, or maybe Syria. Maybe I can make them spit out Iraq? No, Iraq already exists. I can make them spit out Hejaz. Looks like they're losing a war down here to Adal. Really? This is Adal. Wow. I kind of want to go to war with Adal, too. My goal, you see, is to link up my lands. So I want to get this territory here, which I have a core on, so I can link those up. Then I need uh, to link these territories with mainland. So I need to make like a thin little strip down here. And then bring it on down. And that'll link it all up. But that's going to be a lot of infamy. You know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So we're talking 44 infamy. That's a lot. That's going to take years to burn off. And that's just to barely link it up with these tiny little these tiny little corridor where it just barely touches. That kind of stuff is what I'm doing. Like down here, it's just this little corridor to barely touch Cairo. And barely touch down there, and barely touch right here. That's 44. But it'd be nice, because you would make a lot more money. Instead of getting tariffs, you would get tax, and you would also get production. Which is much better. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time where we rekindle the life of Hindustan.